Well, he was a very hard rider, very professional and very dedicated. Um, you know, not um, an easy man to get to know because of this, um, his, his determination. As being one of the most dedicated professional racing motorcyclists that I've ever met. You know, he was a fantastic rider and, you know, really, uh, um, he really had everybody on their toes. You know, he, he was um, perhaps, you know, he's made me a better rider. When you go into a race with uh, any other rider other than Jana, you always know that you've got a chance of beating him. But Jana was so incredibly confident that he, he really had you psyched out before the race started. He had it won. He thought he had it won, and in the end it sort of came over to you. You thought, you know, there's no way you can beat him. He was a professional. He realised the value of presenting a good image to the media. And he would travel anywhere at any time and do anything for the sport, for himself and for Yamaha. As far as presenting the right image, for instance, he really concentrated to, to learn other languages. Uh, he had one time a television interview in Germany and he really concentrated to go through the questions and all the interview was conducted in German. I remember one particular instance in a, in a small Dutch race last year. His 350 had given trouble and uh, it had been repaired and he, before the race we noticed he was going down the grass verges looking at the, looking along the grass verges and afterwards he said to him what are you doing Jana and he said well, he said I'll write the back of the grid and he said if I get a bad start he said I'm going to overtake him and I'll overtake him on the grass and he said I just wanted to make sure there were no potholes <laughs> <laughs>